hello, I'm Dr. Isabel, medical doctor at Doctor on a Mission, and I help people online and one-on-one -on -one reclaim their health so that you can lead a happy and vibrant, long, healthy life without chronic disease. And today, I have a very special guest. It's someone I have known all of my life. It's my mom, Sylvia. Hi, Mom. Hi, Isabel. Thank you for being here. I'm so excited to share with the world about you. The reason we're interviewing my mom here in Washington, D.C. is because mom is almost 90 years young. Yes, and she looks amazing. I love what she does with herself, and I wanted to interview her and have her share Sylvia's Secrets, because this episode is called Sylvia's Secrets on Aging Well. So mom, the first question I wanted to ask you is, yes. How do you stay so happy? Because every time I talk to you, you're just happy and upbeat. What do you do? What are your secrets? Well, I find joy in everything. Yes. When I wake up in the morning, I walk here, and I see all my flowers in bloom greeting me. And I have to say, you can't see this right now, but in, all, in her living room, she's got all these beautiful flowers. And I also grow orchids. Yes, you do. So the room lifts you up, huh? I know. That's the first thing in the morning. Then I keep myself optimistic. And how do you do that, Mom? By reading, like, guideposts and cheerful stories. Yes. And then staying away from people that keep carry the bloom of the world on their shoulders. Yes, because <laughs> negative people are kind of... in. Contagious, aren't they, Mom? Yeah, I stay away from them. Yeah, I personally am allergic to negative people. <laughs> and then, Mom, I also, because I've spent some time with you, what do you do at 3 o'clock in the afternoon? Why don't you share that with everybody? Well, I keep cheerful. So I watch those crazy English program. Are you being served? And I love my, I love silly. And then romance. I, I, I watch as time goes by. Yes. And I love it because she does. She sits for a half an hour and she laughs. And studies have indicated that adults only laugh four to five times a day. Not mom, though. She laughs more than that. And children laugh up to 300 times a day. So we need to be more like children. And mom, that's the beauty of you is you're very upbeat and being around you is just an uplifting experience. Well, you have to keep yourself happy, you know? Yes. Good for yourself, too. And you don't look like you're almost 90. Well, so keep it up. We won't publicize it. Well, we won't tell anybody because mom's actually training for 100. Yeah, yeah, which is what we do at Doctor on a Mission. Now, before we go, I just have one more question to ask you because you've done such a wonderful job of this. Is Mom, your life hasn't been easy. Your childhood was rough. Your marriage was rough. And I just want to see... Why have you not become a bitter person? What have you done to not become a bitter person? Well, first of all, you have to be very brave to face life. Yes, you do. You know, and then you have to forgive. And don't look back. You have to look forward and forget everything that was in your past. If not, it's like carrying a sack of rocks and you're hurting yourself and torturing yourself every day. So what I did, I went on a retreat in uh, the Chesapeake, yeah. and I walked mentally. I had that bag of rock, and I threw it in the water. When I came home, I was a new person, yeah. and I forgot your father and everything he did to me. I just felt clean, clean, clean. So you have to forgive. You have to forgive. And mom, you are not a bitter person, so forgiveness is key, right? It's very important. Would you, would you say, would you agree that forgiveness is one of the re ways that you have stayed so young? Anybody can do it, but you have to forgive and forget and look forward and always have dreams. I'm always finding a dream. Yes, yeah, she's always got some Working beautiful Working on dream. a dream. Yes, definitely. Well, to wrap it up, the two Sylvia secrets for today on aging well is one, be happy, yes, be happy and laugh a lot, and two, forgiveness, just forgive. I, we Look, we respect the fact that forgiveness is hard. Is forgiveness very hard, hard work? Very hard. And sometimes you have to forgive every day over and over and over again, but you just keep on forgiving. So those are the two, is be happy and forgive. 
So I want to thank you for being here, Mom, and sharing your secrets with the world. I love you so much. You're an inspiration to me. And you're an inspiration to me, and that's why I keep myself young. Thank you. <laughs> and I hope people can understand this and practice it, because it takes practice yes. to, to be happy. Yes, and we'll have more series on Sylvia's Secrets. And now I'd like to ask you a question. You know, I'm going to be doing a free webinar series coming up shortly, and I want to ask you a couple of questions. What should I, what should I teach on? What, should, what, what are your stumbling blocks? Are you having stumbling blocks on nutrition, or what are your obstacles that are have help stopping you from moving forward? Let me know, because this free webinar is for you. It's not for me. I've got all this information inside of me that is just busting out, and I want to share it with you. But I need you to tell me what you want to learn about. Nutrition? Is it about mindsets? Is it about obstacles? Is it about myths that you're confused about? How can I serve you? Let me know in the comment section below. And if you like this video, Mom and I would love for you to share it with all your friends and family because we want to help the world get better. Right, Mom? Mom, you do a lot of good. Yeah, you can end up looking like Mom. Yeah, that's my goal. And if you want even more inspiration, why don't you come to our homepage and plug into the movement. All you need to do is go to DoctorOnAMission.com and put in your name and email and you will automatically be plugged into the movement to help you learn ways to be happy and lead a vibrant, long, healthy life without chronic disease. Very important. Now go out there and share that gorgeous smile with the world because we so need it, don't we? <laughs> okay. <laughs> and before we leave, let's remember, let's make a difference. Let's love unconditionally, and let's forgive frequently. Bye for now.